Hi, in this video we will explain the parts of the edit page and give you a quick run through of how you can tweak the specific samples in your beat. Let's get a track going and we'll give you a quick overlook of the sample edit dialog. With the two arrow sliders you can adjust the start and end point of the sample. The fade bar lets you apply fade ins and fade outs. You can also let EXO detect the start point of the sample for you. Apart from this, you can switch between default, inverse stereo and mono mode plus phase shift your sample. Above the pan slider you can find HUSS, which delays the left or right channel of the sample, providing you with a wider sound. You can also pan the audio like you traditionally would. With the pitch slider you can pitch the sample a maximum of 12 octaves up or down. Using the stereo pitch offset, you can offset the pitch of the left and right channel. Tone is a tilt style EQ that increases top frequencies while decreasing the bottom or the other way around. The cut slider will gently remove frequencies above or below the on slider set threshold. We'll save velocity, playback and FX sense for the following videos. Thank you for tuning in and tweak away until next time.